Thank you. Thank you. By the way, give me a report tomorrow morning on the border situation. Gary says it'll take at least a week. I don't want to hear any song and dance from Gary or you, for that matter. It'll be on your desk first thing in the morning. Have you ever had their salmon? It's to die for. And it goes great with the uh, 1959 Chateau Lafitte Rothschild. And I think we should get a bottle. 1959 Rothschild? A Chateau Lafitte Rothschild. I can't refuse that proposition. Because you're not paying for it, that's why. Taxpayers won't feel a thing, John. No, we deserve it. John McNamara speaking. Hold on. Vice President Biden is on the line. Hi, Joe. What can I do for you? What do you want me to do for you now? <laughs> Nothing. I just came over to say hello. Oh, yeah, that's unusual. <laughs> Actually, Orna, do you know any Arab hangouts? Hello. I'm Jewish. Hello, that's why I'm asking. I'd figure you know where to stay away from. <laughs> no, seriously, I, I need to know if these T-shirts say what I want them to say. <laughs> You're such a brat. <laughs> and a user. All right, but you got to go because I'm tapping a subject. Oh, you Tapping a subject. <laughs> you're so cute. Thank you. Oh, Orna, if you're going to be tapping, you might want to use one of these. <laughs> Woo, extra small. Oh, uh, you wish. <laughs> All right. Bye bye now. I want to introduce my guest this evening is Peter Weiss, who is, has served in Geneva in the Euro Parliament. Uh, he is an international weapons expert and he is currently a presidential advisor. Um, Peter, since the recent shootings of, of today, which are absolutely tragic, um, and there is just one after the other, we've got Navy Yard, Sandy Hook, um, the Aurora Movie Theater going back uh, in Denver, and uh, going back even further to Columbine. Uh, I want to start with your thoughts as a weapons expert and a current presidential advisor. Call the Chinese First Lady and talk to her right now. She might be able to do something. Michelle? Michelle, listen to me. The United Nations, can't they do something? We're trying to resolve this problem ourselves without getting them or anyone else involved. We've been led to believe that the terrorists are highly trained and organized. There couldn't be anything further from the truth. How are you so sure? Because I lived with one. But they're Jewish. I know. I was young. But you're still young. And only half stupid. <laughs> I can enter their minds now, Chief. I want to smoke them out of their little holes and put them behind bars. This is only war, Chief. A war. We keep an eye on about 500 cells that have infiltrated but I'm sure there are quite a few more out there that we don't know about that are ready to act at any moment they're called to do so. They can cause quite a devastation in a very short time. So, when do we detonate the nuclear bomb, Chief? Chief? Aren't you the boss? Chief. What's wrong with that? <laughs> You know, I can, I can smell the rat. The moment the one gets close to me. I smell a big rat. You deserve to be skinned alive. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Soros, you have to talk to Soros and tell him about the situation. Soros can't do anything but money. Oh, come on, Joe. You're talking to me, the head of Homeland Security, for God's sake. Last few years, the world moves according to Soros. Oh, come on, Janet. Be serious. Well, never bite the hand that feeds you. You know, you're vice president, thanks to Soros, not Chief, Barack. You are insane. <laughs> no, I'm an insider, not an outsider. So, stop the bullshit and get in touch with Soros as soon as possible before it's too late. Or did you do it already? Come on, you have to let me do this. You give everyone else the best cases, especially Yenny. That's not true. Yes, it is. And I am sick and tired of this treatment. 
Yenny, 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 you know, I'm always the one doing the dirty, thankless, boring work in this office. How can you say that? Because it's true. Yenny, Yenny, Yenny. Well, you better change your tune to Orna, 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 or I demand an immediate transfer. Do you know who you're talking to? I don't care if you're the president. I want and demand respect. I'm not the president, but I can fire your ass in a split second. Your insubordination has come to the limit, and I don't want to put it up with it any longer.